Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a January sales haul because you know, it's January, it's the sales, I love shopping, so you know, you know this is going to happen. For 2017, one of my New Year's resolutions was to film more content for you guys. So if you're not subscribed already, please do because I'm going to be uploading two videos every single week um, during 2017 unless something dramatic happens in my life and I can't upload videos anymore um, but I will be uploading two videos a week. If you subscribed already then don't forget to click the little bell um, symbol next to subscribe and that will just give you notifications when I upload a new video. So I'll start off with Stradivarius first. It's actually quite a new shop in the UK. It's probably only been around for a few years. Um, it's a sister brand to Sarah so a lot of the style is similar to Sarah um, but it's at a lot cheaper price. Sometimes I find items in Stradivarius are very similar or almost identical to Sarah items but like a lot cheaper. I think it's because it's targeted at a younger market so it's a little bit more cheaper but I did pick up three things and I really like them all. The thing about all this haul is I ordered a lot because I was like let me try these on I'm probably going to end up returning some of these um, because you know when you shop online you don't want to miss out on anything so you order it all and when it all came I just love every single thing like I want to keep it all well apart from a couple of things which I'll tell you which I am taking back so first of all from Stradivarius I got this jumper if you follow me on Instagram if you don't then I think you should <laughs> um, you'll, you would have seen me warm worn this a couple of times and the thing is I've actually worn it twice and the tag is still on I'm one of those people who puts it on tries it on realizes that I like it I don't take it off but then I forget that the tag is still on so yeah I've actually worn this twice but the tag is still on it's a jumper with um kind of like a lace-up eyelet detail on the neck area I try all these on so you can see because obviously just holding it up like this doesn't really do any good um, but this was I think it was like £15 so it's quite a bargain it's really comfy as well and the shape is really nice and it just fits really well then got a bodysuit but it's not like a bodysuit bodysuit it's more like a top but it's got like the bodysuit bottom and I think again again this was like 12 or £13 I think it was pretty inexpensive so it's this khaki kind of like a blouse and it's got this cross detail at the top but it goes into a bodysuit at the bottom obviously I'm not going to be able to try the bottom part on and show you guys because that would just be very inappropriate <laughs> but you get the gist in there and it's just normal sleeves I got a cardigan from there as well this was reduced to I think it was quite expensive still I think it was like 40 or 30 pounds still um, I think it was £30 still but I really liked it and I've been looking for one like this forever and I never see them the thing is I love the stuff like this like fringy um, fake fair type of stuff I just think it looks really glamorous and really um, put together it makes even a t-shirt look like a good outfit but the problem I have with these type of clothes is I find that sometimes they're really bulky and they just make you look more hench when you don't want to look hench um, but this one is quite flat and it's quite thin so it's a really flattering cardigan actually and it's got little sparkles in which is coming across really strong on camera because of the light but it's not actually that noticeable in like um, real life um, so yeah it's just this cardigan that I love and I know that I will be wearing a lot especially during spring when I'm just wearing a t-shirt this is going to be like my go-to cardigan jacket kind of thing. Next I shopped at H&M and H&M was doing an online offer where when you bought sales stuff you can get an extra 10% off with a discount code so that is amazing and I just immediately placed an order. I got a couple of things for Aiden but I'm not going to show you those because those are already in the wash um, but these are still in the packet. I had a quick peek but I haven't like properly tried them on or anything. Um, a lot of these I haven't tried on apart from the jumper that I wore a couple of times. I got this sweatshirt. This is, I think it was like £12.50 reduced. Um, it's basically a sweatshirt and it's got again lacy details. You can tell I'm loving this like lacy detail. I think it's going to be a really nice casual sweater to wear with like jeans or even just like leggings or something. Just like a comfy casual top that you just throw on. I also got this bomber jacket which looked amazing online and actually it does look quite nice on but it's just that it's huge like I am a size 8 and they were out of stock on the size 8 
and I thought I'd get a size 10 because you know it's a bomber it doesn't matter if it's a little bit baggy but when it came it just completely drowned me and it's like huge I actually think that I need a size 6 I think even a size 8 would be like pretty big but it's this khaki padded bomber and it's in a kind of like a quite block square style so I quite like that it's not like you know the ones that have a ribbing at the bottom not that type of bomber it just sits like that so yeah I really like it but I'm so bummed that it's so big hopefully when I return it to the store they might have my size in the store hopefully fingers crossed because I do really like it got it for about £15 so that was really good and you know if it's £15 then I want to keep it that's like better than Primark price so yeah hopefully when I go in you know I don't have my size and then I got a pair of shoes which again I need to send back because they're too big I thought I would size up because I have quite wide feet so these kind of sandals I thought I'd get a bigger size so it's more comfortable but it turns out that they're just too big uh, they're basically these sandals these are absolutely gorgeous these are from the premium range so it's real leather and they're reduced from £40 to like £15 and now they've been reduced even more to like £13 on the website and they have a lot of sizes left um, but these are too big these are just going to slip off my feet when I start walking so moving on to Sarah I actually got quite a lot of jackets because I'm on the hunt for some new jackets I've been wearing my jackets for ever now I don't really change my jackets much but I thought because it's a sale I'm going to pick up some new jackets and just change up my style a little bit more um, I've got this navy velvet embroidery jacket that was quite a um, mouthful um, and I love it and I'm going to keep it but the thing is I went on the Sarah website this Sarah order actually took m more than a week probably about 10 days to arrive so I bought this for a discounted price of £40 and then last night I went onto the Sarah website and realised that it's gone down again so this jacket is actually only £20 in the sale right now so I'm going to return this and rebuy it at £20 because I'm not paying £40 when it's only £20 now so yeah it's this velvet jacket and at the back it has the most gorgeous embroidery print and it's actually quite a thick material as well it's not too thin and um, I think it's because it's velvet so I am looking forward to wearing this with like ripped jeans and the sandals which I need to return that would just be like a completely like oh that would be a nice outfit next jacket I got was a jacket that I actually picked up by mistake I actually bought the wrong jacket I saw one that was similar in Sarah last month and it's a shorter style. I tried it on and I fell in love with it but it was like 60 or 70 pounds and I was like hmm it's not really worth 60 or 70 pounds for that kind of jacket because it's not a thick winter coat or anything like that it was just a jacket. So then I saw it in a sale and I thought it was this one but it wasn't. This is a longer style when it came out I was like why is it so long and I realised that it's not the same style it's very similar it looks almost identical but it's just a longer version and it's this jacket it's like a baseball jacket and it's quite long it actually covers my bum and it's just got this ribbon on the cuffs and the bottom hem and then it's just got this nice simple I actually really like this jacket it was 40 pounds so it wasn't too bad but it's just too long it just like swallows me up and I yeah I want the shorter one but I don't think they have it in my size anymore which I'm so pissed about because I could have got it if I just like looked properly by the way this style online shopping was like one of those midnight shopping trips when you can't get to sleep and you go on style.com okay, I also got this bomber which I really need I really need like a thick coat uh, especially when it gets really cold and um, to keep me warm I don't care if it's ugly I don't care if it's big or like baggy or puffy or whatever I just want to be warm especially when I'm like walking the dog or going to the supermarket or taking Aiden to play group or whatnot then I need something that's going to keep me warm I don't care if it looks you know bad but I actually really like this jacket it's really cool and um, it's a Sarah puffer jacket it's pretty oversized as you can see and it's got this zip here which um yeah I think it's a hood I didn't even realize that it was so puffy around here as well but this was reduced to 40 pounds and I got it in a size small but looking at it I think it's pretty big like I know I said I don't care if it's too big but this just looks like a doofy I'll look like I'm wearing a doofy yeah see 
Does it even fit in the screen? Probably not. But uh, lastly, the thing that I got for myself is this play suit, which I'm actually really glad that I picked up. It looks really nice. And if I saw this in the shops, then I wouldn't have bought it because it doesn't look appealing to me. But when I saw it in the model, I thought, oh, that's pretty cool. Like, I could probably pull that off. And when it came out, I was like, oh, yeah, that's actually really nice. So this play suit was, I think it was like 15 or 16 pounds. It's actually sold out now online i actually looked last night to see if it was still um available but it's actually sold out and it's this like it's kind of square sleeved and then it's a really long play suit and it goes into like a baggy wide leg style so it's a bit like a culotte i guess this should be a cropped length because i'm pretty short compared to you know a lot of like models or um western girls then it's like a full trouser length for me <laughs> But I think I can work with that as long as I wear this with high heels. If I wear this with flats, then no, it's just not going to work. It's going to make me look really frumpy. I definitely need to wear it with um, heels and, you know, put a belt on or something to cinch in the waist. But yeah, I really love this. And this is like one of the, those purchases that you're like, yes, I'm glad I bought it. Last but not least, I got some stuff for Aiden from Sarah. I probably didn't get enough, I should have got more, but to be honest, he's got quite a lot of clothes for winter now. Um, I got him this little cardigan. Um, how cute! I really want like a matching one, like this would be so cute if it was in adult size as well and could work together. Yeah, I'm one of those sad mums like that. Um, but yeah, look at that, how cute it is, and it's got like a little um, number at the back. And this is size 12 to 18 months, which he's just starting to fit into. He's actually 13 months now, um, but he was he's quite a small baby, so he kind of like um, has to wait an extra month or two until he fits into his actual size. I also got him these little trousers, which has got a guitar on them. They're like these. Yeah, so cute. I love buying baby clothes. Honestly, it's just like the cutest thing ever. They look like denim but they're not, it's just like a fabric material. And I got him some little booties because he's walking now, he's been walking since he was 11 months but he's now at the point where he just walks all the time. And um, I got him these for when it gets really cold. Right now he's still able to wear his like high top confess and high top boots and whatnot but when it gets really cold he's going to need something like this. Um, it's got a rubber sole so it's not going to be slippery. And inside inside it's lined with like fairy material like a fake fur or like a fake shearling material so that's going to keep him really warm and they're just really cute booties look at them it's got a little buckle on but they're really cute i love them so cute so that was it for my sales haul and i will link everything if i can find it in the information box and hopefully things will still be in stock and hopefully reduced even further don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and i shall see you in my next one bye Mwah.